Good morning, 8.30 a.m. Pacific Standard Time and 11.30 a.m. Eastern Time. And where we gathered here today to talk about the opening bell, left elbow, gap down, entry, exit with profits. And then how to readjust, how to take profits as we did here. We bought the calls right over here where my pointer is. We got these calls and yeah, we had to sell out up there toward the $7 on the high because that's all it was willing to give us. But then we had to come over here on the 605 put where my pointer is and start buying some of these at 550. 540 is a low. They made the morning high of $10.50. So our entry is 100% on the pullback and that's very real. Ka-ching, ka-ching, ka-ching. Based on a left elbow gap down that is where they close the huge left elbow gap down. We're famous that first pop as we did MMTs. That pull back to test that bottom and off it went. But it's having some problem right in here now. And that's why we sold the calls. And how to trade that left elbow called left elbow gap down. It's an SMF term, market maker term. And we're here to service you with it. And the profits that go along with it. And the entries and the exits. And the proof is here. Because it's live and it's in the market. High frequency trading at its very finest. And you get to take a ride with me in the bid and ask. Which is right behind here. Here's the chart right here. That's an MMT chart. And left elbows, they always get these drawdowns. And what we're looking for up here, we want to buy more call contracts. Okay, they're 640 by 680. And we got bids right now live at 550 and have had them out there. But we're going to take a look at how this side of the market was marked down 100% off of the high. 10.50, low 540, entry 5.5. And that is truth. That is honesty. And that is money working at its finest wholesale price. Within the price channel range. Buying the dip over here on the 605 call. Where my pointer is. You can follow my pointer. This is the Google stock. This is the MMT platform at its finest. It's working. It's below 85. Uh, it's minus 35. 85, 0.85, little over three-quarter delta down today, okay? At 92 cents a teeny, okay, in our platform. And the platform is very sophisticated in one thing, is how do I get the pullback over here? I sold at the high on the 605 call. But I bought the lows over here on the 605 put. And how do I add to my position here? And how do I buy the dip over here? But nonetheless, I am going to square the two entries at the best wholesale price I can get on both sides. That is the power of taking advantage and beating them at their game, beating the markets and what they do. High frequency program, computing cycles, everything that you're challenged with. But you can overcome it. And you'll do it with this trading platform because it does not lie. That tells the truth and reversals are here. Left elbows, trade them long, trade them long. Get short over here when it's time using the put strategy of the 605. Uh, how to trade the calls off of the bottom, which we did right here. We're, we got orders at 5.50 here and now. The time is 8.35 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, 7.23, 2012. Right in the middle of making that market and a very high mathematical program frequency, volume frequencies, lower volume frequencies, price scripts and the bid and ask, everything that day traders are not equipped with. It's unfortunate, but things have changed, and you need to get on board now and understand that there is a possibility for you to beat them in their electronic price scripts. 
but you'll only do it here right now live when we're doing it. All the talk and all of that stuff doesn't mean anything. It's one thing. I'm going to buy some more contracts over here now. So I'm going to up the limit for Brian Plain to five more at 590. And then another MMT can buy another one at 570 on the little wiggle and jiggles. The limit order here on the call contract at 550 will remain here and now. Volume 1726, close 990. High 704. We sold this at 690 because I wasn't willing to give us any more. And we had to buy over here on the 605 put. And that's called making a market mechanically along with the equity price movement. Let it be known. Here I am live right now. We're getting down here to that 540. Yeah, the time is. Let us not forget what time it is. It's 838 a.m. Pacific Standard Time at a 545, 560. In your face, on the pullback, with the put side working at the 550 entry, 650, 680, all on the same video. We got that reversal, but it all started with that left elbow and trading that long side and then trading that reversal. Now, what I will do with MMT is on this particular reversal, we're still elevated here at 65 and 46. We're not even reaching negative half delta yet. So if that's going to happen, MMT, this bid here of our 550 by 580, you can see how stable that is based on your MMT platform before your face right now. And it is and that's what it's doing. So we know that it's the truth. And we know that this side just hit a peak from our entry, a dollar up, 640 by 680. This side, well, it's right here, 550 by 580. Imagine that on the 605 call. And guess what? I go buy it. Why? Because I'll tell you why. I already sold this at $6.90. I'm buying a pullback here. And I want to be wholesale, just like we did over here on the 605 put now. And the thing about it is the IR is above 65. And we're at 0 0.46, if I have the right readings, minus 7.3 Odinis, minus $6.73. With a 66 IR on a pullback with the left elbow bottom entries, exits live, Time, 8.40 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Bid now is going to 6.05 call. It's a 5.50 by 5.80. I got a 5.50 by 5.80. And how do I get wholesale to risk here, dollar capital wise? And how do I stay wholesale over here too? And how do I make a good world out of uh, taking advantage of the mechanical robots that are in the pricing control scripts within the actual equity prices which are pegged to the option robot high frequency in prices and how to take advantage of these prices this is what you do and we do it live this is live market hours this isn't something pre-recorded and all that day trading stuff and advertising you see no now, I am going to say that we're pulling back over here and we have to move in. Start moving in at 590 here and we'll buy some at 520 and 4.7 on the 605 call. Time to start buying that call. There, we peaked right here at 6 by 630. 620, 660 is printed off here. That was a dollar up from that low on that put side. 1050 was the high, end of day morning to the markdown of our entry. We took 100% out of that so that we could... And now we're going to buy again over here and we're going to trade it up and we're only going to scale a low volume amount. And that's a, Yeah, going at 590. I'm OK with that on a very low volume. I no, I will take the put option and I'll start adding more over here at 520. Should it go that way? Um, once again, for the new people or the old people that have been around a long, long time. And you came out of the day trading boom or wherever you came from, because I'm sure that that's where you came from. It's not like that anymore.
They're outdated programs. Yes, standard technical analysis manipulated. This is price range bid and ask. It's all about how high frequency is executed so that you can beat them at their own game and walk away with the money. I will conclude the 605 call. I will conclude it's 8.43 a.m. I will conclude that today's date is 723 of 2012. And I will conclude SMF market makers making markets across the board, calls, puts, equity prices, and many, many, many other various different tools that are used within the new markets, the new markets with the high frequency in it, and how I can teach you how to beat them, and how they make those bottoms, and why I got to own the call over here now, because it's going to make me own it because it's reversed, so I can take a small position over here. How to get the entry, how to sell, you've already sold once here, you bought wholesale over here at 550, 10 cents off the low, 1050 was a high, 605 put. Congratulations.